Do you want to start your own vlog, but you find yourself overwhelmed and stressed out by all of the gear you need? Well, I have some good news for you. And that is that you don't need to be stressed out and you don't need to feel overwhelmed by all of the gear. I encourage you to just start. Start with the best camera that you could possibly use and that is the camera that you have with you. Start with a phone if that's what you have. Start with a DSLR if you already have one. Start with that and build the skill set of being able to present on camera, come up with content and share that with an audience. But don't feel overwhelmed by having to learn about lighting and sound and cameras and lenses and depth of field and all of this stuff before you even start. And here's the funny thing. Once you eliminate gear out of the equation, what you'll probably find is that you were just using it as an excuse. And maybe there's something else that's holding you back from starting that vlog. Maybe you're afraid of putting yourself out there or there's some other internal work that you need to do. We've actually done another video just on this topic. So check that out as well. The next step is when you're ready and when you've put some vlogs out into the world, and then you wanna think about how you can upgrade them, get in touch with someone who is already producing high quality video content. If you have a friend who's already in the video game or you know a production company, reach out to them and they can help advise you as to what gear you should look at, what lenses to buy, what cameras to buy, what lighting you might need to give you the look that you want. So gather up some samples of vlogs that you really like and use that as a starting point. Because trust me, there is so many variables to consider in the video world that your best bet is to seek advice from someone who knows what they're talking about. Our doors are always open. We've helped lots of students and lots of clients put together kits so that they can self-produce their own work and we're more than happy to do that. So there you have it. I really want you to understand that you don't need to let gear be the thing that holds you back. Just start, refine the skills and then adapt over time. When we started in video, we didn't have a equipment hire company and all the bells and whistles and fancy gear that comes with it. We started with a tripod, one camera and a lens and we built from there over time and I encourage you to take the same approach. Thanks for watching guys. I hope you got a lot out of this video. And if you did, hit like, hit subscribe so that you can see more content just like this. See you next time.